Yeah, it's recording now. Okay, here's the deal. So I bought a Hoover pause vacuum, and I don't have the vacuum with me, of course, I didn't bring it to work, but I'm doing this video blog to show you. Here is the canister. If you go to YouTube, you will find no information on YouTube of how to actually get this canister apart. Now the problem is, is that when you open it up, and you can empty it, it works out really well in some aspects because you can empty the stuff from the vacuum, right? So simple enough. However, the part that really messed me up is I have a dog and so all the hair would get stuck up and around there, which means not only do you have to clean the filter, which you do right here, and this part was easy, so you can take out the filter and wash it, okay? Yuck, I know it's gross. Um, but the part that I had to actually take the darn thing to the vacuum repair place and have them help me get it open because you have to turn it toward you <laughs> and see it doesn't work. And I'm not a weak woman, so how the heck, and he did it finally, but even the guy, see this is why I hate this, see it should work, right? It's a little thing, <laughs> and see, once again, I will have to take it back to the guy, because it doesn't friggin' open. I have had it. So this is why, other than that little issue, it's a really good vacuum. And the funny thing is, is there's nothing on YouTube about how to do it. It has to do with turning the darn thing counterclockwise, which I'm doing, and it doesn't work. So, that's my dilemma of the day. If you can help, let me know. Thank you.